So cute. Great way to end our five o'clock news. Yeah, coming up next now at six, new video shows how a local rescue crew braved stormy seas to rescue passengers on board a sailboat after it crashed into the rocks. Plus, a family is rocked by the sound of a massive explosion hitting their home. What caused their ceiling to collapse? That's next on our News at 6. See you in a few. Now at 6, search warrants served at the Santa Barbara company that owned the diving boat that caught fire and killed 34 people. And at this hour, four crew members are still missing after a cargo ship overturns and catches fire off the coast of Georgia. Hello, everybody. I'm Rick Chambers. And hi, I'm Courtney Friel. The KHLA 5 News at 6 o'clock starts right now. And we want to begin with that developing news from Santa Barbara County, where federal agents served search warrants on the owners of the dive boat that caught fire and sank back on Labor Day. 34 people were killed, and the cause of that fire is still unknown. KTLA 5's Kareen Winter is live in Santa Barbara with the latest on this. What happened today, Kareen? Well, Courtney, I can tell you that the FBI, we've been monitoring all of the activity out here all day, and we've seen them removing boxes of items from two boats behind me now it's an unclear exactly what those contents were or how crucial they will be to this investigation teams of federal